Right, so I'm back in Rule of Fallout 4, and today we are back on Tales from the Commonwealth. The quest line where we explore various tales in the Commonwealth. I'm pretty sure I don't... June, we haven't rented that room yet. Also, you gotta buy me dinner first. Okay, well, whatever. Um, as I was saying, many tales in the Commonwealth are still left to be explored. So yeah, last time around, we found the two brothers Jack. One of those guys was a synth. I never did find out which one was the actual synth, but uh, that asshole mercenary guy started demanding cash for me, uh, so I just ended up murdering everyone, because I don't like ultimatums, and I also don't like paying cash. But anyway, speaking of June, uh, we're out here to actually replace her with Ellen, who's right over there. I mean, June's got character, she's got heart, but she's dumb as a pile of fucking bricks, so we're gonna be replacing her with Ellen, the cartographer, who's a tiny bit brighter, because she's a cartographer. I've never met any cartographers, but I'm assuming they're probably pretty bright. I mean, you gotta at least be able to draw, which I'm pretty sure June can't. I'm not even sure if she can read, but yeah. So she's gonna be staying right over there. Me if you need a room, we're gonna close this door right here to make sure that June does not hear us, and we're gonna hire Ellen. Hello there, my name's Ellen. You may be just what I need. Are you free to talk for a bit? I've asked everyone around here, but no dice. I'm a cartographer. That means I make maps. I've been exploring our great former America for some time now, trying to create the best route available to reunite the country with itself. But apparently, no one knows how to get anywhere. I guess it's up to me, right? Let me ask you this. Would you use a map of a region if I made one? Well, I already got, like, Apple Maps on my pit boys, so I'm pretty set already. But, uh, sure. I'm sure your parents were thrilled about your hobby. They were. Wait, was that a joke? I'm not even sure. Never mind. Well, you look like a traveler to me. That's good. That's good. Wait, is that a Pip-Boy? Where'd you get that? Wait, actually, no. Don't answer that. <clears throat> I'll be straight with you. I'm looking for someone to accompany me through the Commonwealth. I need to make more maps of this region, and I just got to this place. And that pit boy of yours could help a lot on exploring the places. Are you sure you can handle yourself though? I mean, I've seen your common abilities in the future, and I wasn't so impressed. You got body slammed a bunch of times. Anyways, uh, we're back in the past now, so you get an opportunity to redeem yourself here. So I guess, uh, just You're go on. I'm listening. Oh wow, that's better than I expected. You get some backup to help you when you need it, watch your back, and things like that. And I get to check out all the places here on the Commonwealth. I think it's a win-win for the both of us. So, what do you say? Oh, but you have someone following you already. Damn. Well, I'll ask you anyway. What do you say? Uh, sure thing. Sure thing. Alright, time to explore then. Now, uh, June, I know what you're thinking. It's not what it seems, okay? The thing is, you're just dumb as a pile of fucking bricks. But, uh, you got some dogs you still gotta take care of, though. You haven't fed them in about, uh, two months. Maybe about three. I lost count. Hey. Really? June. Hey there. Yep. June, stop walking into a wall. June, I think it's time for us to split up. This relationship has really just run its course. I'll go cool my heels then. Yeah, you go do that. Let's see. Where do you live again? Um. Yeah, whatever. You go to the castle where all the last companions go. Now, uh, June, it's, it's not you, it's me, okay? Ringo, stay here. Alright. Anyways, we're gonna go over to the Boston airstrip and uh, follow another one of these tales from the Commonwealth. This one being about a bunch of Brotherhood soldiers. I'm saving up to start an orphanage. There's a lot of lost children in the Commonwealth and they need our help. Beat it. Hey there. This place can get really dirty. I really can't stand a mess. The bleachers aren't that much better than the field. You're so much further removed from the action. Noodles are the official eats of Diamond City. You should try some. Yeah? <clears throat> I get a bit compulsive when I have a broom in my hand. And if there's dust on the counter, then look out. Johnny's coming for you. When the hell did you get the steak from? We don't have money for nice this. Boy. You keep your cat eyes to yourself. Um, anyways, I don't think I've ever seen that guy right there before. 
So he might be a two from the Commonwealth. I'm not Just even sure anymore. Great day in the best city in the world. Well, let's not over exaggerate. This place is still a shithole. You ever wonder if what Scribe Jameson said was true? <sighs> not this again. Why? What did they say? Jameson's the initiate who said he got kidnapped by aliens. Ended up in the psych ward. But I know Jameson. The guy was as sane as they come. Yeah, I heard he was a fine soldier. Even the best of us can lose our heads, given all the horrible things we see every day. Besides, I know for sure Jameson didn't see anything. How's that? Because no alien in their right mind would travel thousands of light years to come to this godforsaken hellhole. If you got time, I need you to run an errand for me. One of our regular patrols hasn't been heard from in weeks. I want you to check out the area and make sure nothing's happened to them. Yeah, this is a good question. Why do you need my help? I mean, I knew this guy once that had a bunch of fetch quests for me. Did not end well with us. He won't talk to me anymore. Why do you need my help? Because in the Brotherhood we follow orders. If it were up to me, I'd be out there myself tearing up the wasteland for that patrol. But I got assigned to protect the base. So that's where I'm going to stay. But you, you're freelance, right? Well, that means there's nobody better served to find them. I'm convinced. Right? I'll see what I can do. Right, well, I guess we're gonna try and rescue some people uh, that got kidnapped by aliens. I got kidnapped by aliens once. And then I took over a starship. That was a long time ago, though. Anyways, I did not take over that starship on my own. I had help from a samurai, a cowboy, and a medic, as well as a little girl. It was a very interesting day that day. But, let's see. Those don't look like aliens. My god, the sun is so powerful, it shines straight through solid concrete. Anyways, we gotta go in here, I guess. I've never seen this door before. I'm just gonna casually do that. Uh, that ghouls. Living ghoul. That ghoul. Alright, what transpired here? Are, are you real? You can't be, they never are. Yeah, exactly. Don't you recognize the Silver Shroud? Oh, you must not have heard. I'm a superhero. I do this for a living. So this is a rescue? Well, you're too late. I've already turned, ghoul. You're speaking to a dead man. Knight Cassia said we had no choice but to kill ourselves. She said it was our sworn duty. It was so easy for her. I don't know how she found the courage, but I can't stop asking myself. Is it the right thing to do? Am I not still human? Well, I mean, you're human. Your skin is just kind of like beef jerky. Yeah, it may be tasty. I'll be a nice guy. You don't have to do this. It'll be all right. Yeah. Maybe I'm not human anymore. And I can still think for myself. I still have time. Just give me a second. Yeah, if you still want to go for option B, I got a very nice shotgun right here. Bye. Just give me a second. Okay. Whoa. Ah, man. I told you, I could have used my shotgun. I'll just use it anyway. Alright, well. I guess they drank just a tiny bit too much here. Should have stayed away from the vodka. I wouldn't sit here for too long. Ah, right, well, that was a lot less complicated than I thought it would have been. No aliens. Hey. Yeah? Hey. Hello. Red, right, your thoughts. Your thoughts? So, wanna get a beer as we explore? I could use something refreshing. Okay, just don't mind me, I'm vibrating. Just ever so slightly. Just curious what you're thinking. Before you ask, yes, I know how to shoot and use a rifle. Maybe a bit too much. So, do you feel safe knowing that a bunch of xenophobes have access to high-grade military weaponry? I know I don't. 
Uh, they're practically harmless. I mean, they got like these things that fly around in the air. They're basically paper mache. That's all. Sure. Anyways. So, any news on that patrol? Uh, I guess I'll spare Vask if you want some. They're dead, Paladin. I recovered their tags. Damn. I still can't believe it, but looking at your face, I can't say you're lying either. How did it happen? They were ghouls. They had to be destroyed. Then you should be commended for doing so. Doesn't matter who they were in their past life. The moment they turned, they were a threat to the Commonwealth. In any case, I'll make sure those tags get to where they need to be. Good work, soldier. Alright, well, that was, uh, that was a rather short tail right there. I guess we're gonna find another tail, Ringo. Don't you worry. We'll find a long tail for you one day. <laughs>